to predict the outcome. What an enticing prospect. Manchester United are lining up. Number 20. And here we are at one of the great venues for football anywhere in the world, Old Trafford in Manchester. I'm Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Manchester United up against Aston Villa. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And here's the lineup for Manchester United. Victor Lindelof plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. Scott McTominay starts alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. And here's the starting 11 for Aston Villa. Luca Digne plays with Matty Cash in the fullback positions. John McGinn plays with Leon Bailey in the wide areas. And it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal scoring threat. Can he put them in front? Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Ollie Watkins. On to McGinn. Showing good defensive judgment. Look at Dinia. Bubakar Kamara. And Cash with it. Leon Bailey. Bubakar Kamara. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. And that's great work to keep it in play. Lindelof. Here's Luke Shaw. Decisive in the tackle. And a throw in here. Here's Luke Shaw. Bruno Fernandes has it. It's with McTominay. And now with McGinn. Douglas Luiz. Patient build up at the moment. Well, it was a good looking sequence, but it comes to an end. Look at Dinia. It's with Douglas Luis. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Diogo Dallo. And scope for them to produce something exciting. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Sofian Amrabat. Diogo Dallo. Really good, strong tackle. And it'll be a throw in. Lindelof. Harry Maguire now. And a fine tackle. And swiftly ending that attack. And so the referee blows the whistle. We've reached the halfway point here at Old Trafford.
into the second half then. And these two sides are locked together. Just can't really choose between them at the moment. Bubakar Kamara. Look at Dinia. John McGinn. No high quality defending. Look at Dinia. Here is Digne. And he keeps going. Anthony. Sofian Amrabat. Can he put it in? Oh, might be. And that was goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. It's absolutely remarkable. His reflexes were brilliant there. They favoured a short one here. Ericsson. Trying to chisel a chance out of it. Bailey, Zaniolo, can they forge ahead, they do, and you've got to say they're good value for the lead. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Rashford. Twenty minutes remaining. Here's Luke Shaw, and it's with Amrabat, and he's beaten him here. Good patient build up as they try to fashion something. And will it be the leveler? Terrific piece of anticipation. Time for a change then. Keen to take it short here. Rashford. Textbook defending inside the box. Rashford! And a goal here. Just what Manchester United required. They are level. Well, here it is again. And the defending simply isn't good enough. They have to react quicker, deal with the danger and show more urgency. None of which they did, and that's the result. Well, they needed that and so did he. Just look at the manager's relief there. So the ball is rolling again at one all. John McGinn. 
How can they nudge in front late on here? A chance to whip it in. He might be able to carve something out. Well, he didn't miss by all that much. Wide in the end. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Reguilon. Harry Maguire now. Five minutes left. Reguilon. Lindelof now. Reguilon. Here's Juan Bissaka. Christian Eriksen now. On to Juan Bissaka. Still level here, but Manchester United making a push near the end. Surely! Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Manchester United know they've got to be precise with the corner, given the circumstances. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, it was a crowded penalty area, but the keeper's done well to hold on to that. And the referee blows the whistle. Still all square at the end of 90 minutes. And now it is all about the penalty shootout. Goalkeeper beaten from the spot. And he steps up to take his penalty. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. Well, it's all about keeping a cool head. And he's beaten the keeper. And it wasn't the greatest penalty. And it's been saved by the keeper. He had to score, and he does. Can he keep his cool? Superbly done. How many players would try that? In it goes. Can he get the better of the keeper? Well, the Panenka has duly fooled the goalkeeper. Well, the responsibility is on his shoulders. Failure to score, and they lose. And there it is, perfectly executed. Job done from the spot. And there is the big moment in this penalty shootout. The goalkeeper's contribution means they have won it. Well, that's a top-class save. No wonder he's celebrating. That's a brilliant moment for him.